Today is the day that I beat Hard Boiled Mode in every single one, um, one night of Plumpy's game. I almost said Onaf game. On, 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 Onaf. I don't know how to pronounce it. Also, I heard how many eyes here signif signifies when. No! Oh, it's 12 a.m. Wait, wait, he, in, he killed me so quick. No, we're not. Oh, no. Please, I pray to the gods. Why did I flick my camera down? Why didn't he leave? There you go. Why are you doing that? I, d I delayed as long as I can. Please, I delayed as long as I could. Please. Yes! <sighs> Thank you. I earned that one. Second try. Or was that my third try? Up. Oh, what the heck? Oh, it's faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Golden Flumpty. Yay. Hey, I got a star. Oh, yay, now I just gotta beat Harold Boiled Mode on the second game. Yippee. Hard Boiled Mode. Luckily, this one just is my re uh, purely on my reaction skills. I'm dead. I just got destroyed. I, I literally, I, I don't know why I didn't just wait. Like, it doesn't even kill you that quick. What? Yo, he was at 300. I'm pretty sure he was at 300, right? I'm not crazy. I swear it was at 300 and nowhere near that. I didn't even see him in the camera. This uh, might not be working. I, how did I miss it twice? It's because the screen moved when my my mouse went on one side because the screen moved and it moved out the way and I missed it. No! 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 I'm not going back there again, dude. What? It, what? It, am I tripping, or was he not in that vent? What the? Huh? What is? What happened? He wasn't in the camera. I'll try it just one time. Yeah, he he killed me anyways. So I'm pretty sure if you don't look at him, you he kills you. Which I don't know why he killed me that, that first time when he did that. I was looking at him. What? What? Why is this on my screen? Are you making fun of me? What is this? What? That's getting an Easter egg? What was that? Who was that? I was Grunkfus. No! That was horrible. That was horrible. Just give me 6 a.m. That was so bad. Grungfist, I'm not flipping down. I'm not turning my lights on until you appear. Damn it. They forced me into a corner. No! Please, 5 a.m. Please, 6 a.m. Please. Dude, if someone even appears for a second, I'm dead. <laughs> 6 a.m. Oh, God, no. 
This is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Yes! I can't believe that. I didn't think it was gonna happen. I just beat it. Oh. Beating an egg! Kidnapped person wins Flumpty Bumpty's game after countless citizens of New Dork have been abducted by the mysterious Flumpty Bumpty to play his survival hide-and-seek game. One has bested Flumpty and earned the privilege of becoming Flumpty's new best friend. Yes! Allegedly, Flumpty has constructed a skinless, many-headed monster out of the corpses of the, his game's unfortunate past contestants. Yeah, it's probably made for me dying 40 times. What are these? Fever dream skin ask askin or just skin to the left. What are these talking about? What? Have you ever wondered what it would be like to swallow a human baby? I mean an entire baby all at once. It's totally doable if you have a big enough mouth. Which would they die from suffocation or stomach acid? Uh something. A live baby would probably be brutal to the intestines, yeah. Flumpty once broke into a man's house because he was cooking an egg. Flumpty was violently arrested for breaking and entering just so he could escape prison. Alright. It is written in the something script. Uh, excellent scroll that Flumpty once presented a heartfelt speech about the importance of life and, the, and then promptly uh, something a passing stranger in the face. The stranger did not survive. They impromptuously shot a stranger, a passing stranger in the face. I think that's what it said. Yesterday, Flumpty killed approximately a hundred billion birds with one stone. That stone was a meteorite, and yesterday was the apocalypse. Jonah Firm is here. I am very thankful for the response of one night of Flumpty's received, and without the support of the Five Nights at Freddy's community, I would never have made this special. Or made a sequel. That's. I sound stupid now. While I don't want to linger, and. While I don't want to linger, or. make new fan games, I've had a lot of fun with these projects. It's been a great learning experience, and I've met some really wonderful people. Scott Cawthon, thank you for being such a huge inspiration to me and so many others. Best wishes to you, sir. <sighs> hey guys, editing plus in two here to tell you that I technically already beat the hard-boiled mode for One Night at Flumpty's 3, but I didn't get it on recording. So, um, yeah, I'm doing it again. I have to say goodbye to my sanity now. I could try. It's not nearly as hard as 1A of Flunchies 2. That was horrendous. I didn't try it. He's still there? Bruh, I thought he would have been gone by now. He was there for like, what? Like, three minutes? The heck? Alright. Flumpty night. And those are my two new cameras. I need to. No! No! I was just about to leave! I was just about to leave! I hate you. This is not looking good. What the? Killed me so quick. I swear, I swear, some something's changed. Some things are changing. There's no way he killed me that quick. What's up, guys? Editing Plush City 2 back again. Uh, basically, I, I just want to walk you through what's going on here because it's a very complicated thing. Uh, not only is it Plumpty Night, but it's also Plumpty Night on hard mode. Now, there, there's a couple key things that I need to look out for. Uh, mainly, the main Flumpty in the hallway, uh, that Flumpty at the very top with the laser door and the power, because he will shut off your power really quick. And the two, the two door Flumpties and the vent Flumpty. Almost all of them are real threats, some of them aren't really. 
But as you can see, I prefer to have the heat all the way up so I can watch things for longer. Also, uh, Shadow Flumpy was chilling on my wall, don't know what he was doing. Uh, but one thing I did notice here is that I kept the doors, uh, the laser doors, like the main two doors, on for too long, or way too long. I think I was just really paranoid that I was going to die if I didn't. And yeah, I, just, I really didn't want to lose here. I was at 5 a.m. I, I did not want to die. And it, it's very anxiety-inducing because you never know because I was constantly worried that I'm going to forget one of them and then I will die. And the rooms keep switching and there's just so many. But here, finally, uh, I can open the door. We're almost there, boys. And I just flash this guy. Pause. Power's out. And as you can see, that I just said, the power is indeed gone, but we won. Yes. Yes. Finally. I got that on recording. I beat all three. I beat all three in one video. That was stressful. Hey, you got to see the cutscene. Here we go. I have it on recording. Finally! Oh! My power runs out all the time at the end. <laughs> but look! Everything is normal now. It's not a wasteland. And there's no more apocalypse. You think they referenced the apocalypse in the second game? Because on the newspaper I'll it said... I'll miss you. Oh, I'll miss you too, buddy. Yay! There we go! Every single hard boiled mode has been beat. Everything, I've 100 percented every game. Unless there's like an achievement that I didn't get. Or there's achievements, which I doubt. I'll let this play out. Yep, uh, this should be the last time I play One Night of Flumpties on my channel. Unless it's like a fan game, then it probably won't be. <sighs> Ooh, 